Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dryda Matsuro and we are here with another video. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more gaming content and we're going to get straight into the video. But before we do get straight into the video, I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to the supporters that's on my screen. A big shout out to Sam Meyer aka The Real Light G, Weez G and Z Gaming. Foxy Clats V5, Crazy Boss V31, and even Moldy Superman YT. Now these people are our channel members on our YouTube platform, and I would like to give a big shout out and thank you for their support. So with that all said, let's get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, this video is all about the Island Heist in the single player so make sure you do download and install all of the latest requirements that's inside my description below. Once you have completed that, then download this mod, I will leave this mod inside my description below as well. Once you have completed that, then this is required so you must download this. So download the Enable All Interiors mod and I will leave this mod inside my description below as well. So make sure you do download this. Now once you have finished downloading all of the requirements and the mod and installing the requirements then all you gotta do is go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click and open file location. Now as you can see I have already installed my requirements so I don't need to do them right now. But before you guys do anything, go to your scripthookv.net.ina file, double click and make sure you do change this from none to insert because you must change this. Okay guys, so change it to insert. But unfortunately I have already changed it so I don't need to change it to insert. Now once you have completed that then we can get started. So go to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder which I am already in and now go into your scripts folder and now as you can see inside my scripts folder is completely empty. So make sure you do open up your latest native UI extract folder and now inside that folder there will be two files now make sure you go and select both files and drag it inside your scripts folder. Exit out of your extract folder. Now open up your island heist extract folder. And now all you gotta do next is open up that folder that's inside the extract folder. And now select all the files and folders except for the how to start mod.txt. And now drag them all inside your scripts folder. Now all you gotta do next is open up your enable all interiors extract folder. Now the next thing, thing you gotta do is drag this on the side, open up the EAI folder that's inside the extract folder. Now select all the files and folder and drag it inside your scripts folder. Now really important, do not press replace, just only press skip these files. And then there we go. Now exit out of your extract folder. And now all you gotta do next is go back to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder, right click, refresh your game folder, exit out of your game folder, right click, refresh your desktop, and I'll see you guys in the game. And welcome back, and we are here as Franklin. So all you guys gotta do once you're in the game, you can go to your map, okay, and now uh, you can go and teleport there or drive there if you want to. So what you can do is that you can open up your phone straight away, go to your contacts and now go right down the bottom and now you can purchase the submarine. Now just call the submarine and now what you can do is that you can purchase the submarine where you are right now. Now all you got to do is buy the submarine and now you can choose a flag or what kind of flag you want. I'm going to leave it as USA, buy the flag, 
Now, with the colors, you can change the colors if you want to, but I'm going to leave the colors as default. You can buy the Zuna Station, the Guided Gun Missile, and you can buy the Weapons Workshop. Um, you can upgrade the C. Um, the colors, I'm not going to buy the colors. Weapons, um, Lock On Missiles, you can upgrade that. Um, I'm not going to buy any colors. I'm going to leave all the colors as de as default. Um, once you're happy with the colors, you can save the colors if you want to. Just press enter on save colors. And then now that's all you gotta do. Now over here in your wardrobe, you can change your clothes if you want to, or change your outfit, or save your outfit. But it's totally up to you. Um, so that is it. So, all you gotta do next is back out of your menu and now go back to your phone again and now go to your contacts then go right down the bottom and now press enter on enable interiors now this menu will pop up go to change and interior then now go right down the bottom now all you gotta do is go over here now just press enter and now make sure this is what, all this is on true okay and make sure that uh, disable North Yankton when closer is disabled okay once you are uh, finished with that okay you're basically done I think yeah then now uh, go back to MISC options now make sure that this is enabled and make sure that this is enabled as well you can enable this if you want to, it's totally up to you. And you know, you can enable this if you want to, it's, it's just totally up to you. But the most important thing you must enable is load NP maps, okay? It's that one up there. That's the most important one you gotta do. Now back out, go to refresh interiors, press enter. Now back out again. Now go on your keyboard and now press insert. Now your game will freeze for only a few seconds, don't worry, and there you go. Now all you got to do next, okay, is go to over here somewhere, Let me go over here. Now press F8 on your menu, and now you can just teleport there, okay. Wherever your, wait, wherever your submarine is, yeah, it's over there. Now all you gotta gotta do next, okay, is just go over go over here, and now just jump up here, open up your menu, go to vehicle options, and then now oh wait, go sum up, then now go to vehicle spawner, find a boat, uh, sea shark. And there we go, and now let's go to our submarine, wherever it is. Now once you come over here, okay, the next thing you gotta do is press F on your keyboard to jump off. Oh, well, not like that, you know, but um, yeah, you know what I mean. Now, all you gotta do is just come straight here. You can go over there if you want to, but I wanna come straight here. If you do fall underneath the map, okay, then you did it wrong what now as you can see I did not fall underneath the map so I did it right now over here you can come over here and you can sit over here and you know shoot your missiles or whatever but um, we're gonna go and test out this mod to see if it works so you, all you gotta do is come over here to this white marker or gray and I press E on your keyboard and now the island heist has started now the island heist will start at the airport over here now all you gotta do is you can just fly there if you want to or you can be like me and just teleport there which is faster now once you are, once you are at the airport okay um, I'm just going to try and quickly get there and now we are inside here now with this part okay i'm going to skip it because um 
it's gonna take a long time okay so I'm gonna skip it and I'll see you guys there once you are inside here okay so as you can see it does work okay and um, you yeah. just go over here and then and then now uh, you yeah, just drive basically uh, but um, I'm not gonna go through this whole thing okay because we already know what this mod does okay so um yeah I'll see you guys at the end of this mod and now we're here we are nearly there and all you gotta do is just just come through here and then there you go and now like, there will be a cutscene now I'm not gonna go through this whole game okay because it's gonna take about maybe a couple of hours so I'm gonna pause the game and then now I'm, I'll see you guys on my PC and we are back again so I hope you guys do enjoy this mod this mod is an awesome mod so make sure you guys do install the latest requirements and make sure you do install the latest enable all interiors okay that is a big must and unfortunately that this mod does not work on pirate version so if you do have a free GTA V game then I highly recommend buying the game do not be a cheapskate and now use a free version okay so like always guys if you do get stuck installing this mod then let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you guys out or if you get stuck installing any other mods then let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you guys out and if you guys would like any help with any other mods then you can go inside my description below and now you can join my support server on my discord server and I will be more than welcome to help you guys out but if you guys do get stuck installing the island heist mod then I will leave the developers discord server inside my description below as well so make sure you guys do join it and now ask for help so with that I said if you guys did enjoy this mod then let me know and if you guys did like this video smash that like button and subscribe for more gaming content and tutorials and i'll see you guys on my next video thank you for watching peace and i'm out